Hello everyone, my name is Shakil Osan. Today I'm going to show you how to download Composer and install Composer to ready your project environment. So you can work with your YouTube API, Google API. So now, for a start, you need to download composerzeta.ex. Go to this website, gatecomposers.com org and press here to download it save it right click and open this file okay this is the composer so before you set up start composer you need to know where is your xmpp is running this is my xmpp folder this is my xmpp and I am going to work on this project. Y cube. Right now this is blank. So just I'm showing you. This is my folder. I'm going to copy this folder path and minimize this one. And now I'm going to set up computer. Right click run as administrator. Press install anywhere. It will ask your permission. Press yes. Wait a little moment, it will open a pop up for you. This is the pop up. Select developer mode because I am going to use my local host. Developer. Next, it will ask your project root directory that means XMPP root directory. This is my root directory. Just I select, you know, just I show you. This is my project root directory. Stdocs, white. Right now it's back. Next, it will ask you to show the PHP exe file. So it's saying go to your project root directory and then select XMPP, XMPP, PHP, and the last one, PHP, exe. Open it. So your XMPP, PHP, then PHP.e. Press next leave it as it is press next here is my destination this is my destination path that means my project root this is my system path and here is the PSP information now press install it okay we have successfully done to ready compiler composer now close everything open your ex mpp root folder xmpp root folder so i'm going to start my xmpp xmpp right here run again this tutorial press yes okay my xmpp is starting okay it's just starting. so now i'm going to run everything in a common mode because you see here is the common line how you will stop it's very easy just click here this is my terminal and now copy one by one copy this line okay here is another thing we need to follow this is not our project root directory so i need to select my project root directory i'm going to copy this project root directory here is a simple comment cd space slash d space my root directory and slash press enter okay right now i am running our comment from my root directory here i am going to run this file just copy this line as it is and paste here press enter Okay, and now just copy the second file, second line, get you there, and just paste here and enter. And then you win. Enter. Press enter. Okay, it will download a small file. Okay, 
now run this and press enter okay so it will generate some composer pair file in our root directory project root directory i am going to show you the project root directory right now you see here is some file but here we need to add another file manually it's called a json composer.json if here is composer.json file is missing so i'm going to make a new file just take a new file and i'm going to name it composer.json yes i want to uh, make this file from a dot json okay where i need to add a simple code This is my simple code and save this it's simple second bucket then quotation equal then metal view and then bucket close so save it okay let's save now i'm going to check my composer is ready or not i can check this composer with simple command C -O -P -P -O -S -E -R. Composer space version. Okay, if you see this is skin, if you see this is skin, after write down this shot, now that your composer is ready for right now. And finally, I'm going to activate. Let me install it uh, so we can get uh, our vendor folder in this route. Right now, you see here is nothing, just three for file and I'm going to download it from it write down a short note PSP composer peer stop press enter okay it will download some file uh, from github to your local PC so it will take a little time okay so you see that our auto load file is ready right now so if i'm going to my project root folder refresh it you see here is our vendor and this is my auto load this is how you can install composer on your local host and you can maintain the dependency for you know, working with your youtube api or google api thank you for watching this video don't forget to subscribe here or don't forget to suggest me how I can improve everything. Thank you.